Welcome climate viewers. Today is October 23rd, 2014 and I'm up late doing some coding. It's 3 o'clock in the morning uh, working on Climate Viewer 3D here and I, my internet is just acting really stupid so I started to look into it and um, apparently I'm not alone. So there's these people are saying that there's wind damage all across the world causing these power outages. Let's look into that. So I'm over here and uh, we're talking 16 hours ago, Google services clobbered by temporary outage glitch takes out Gmail and Google Drive. 9-11 services lost for 11 million people. Did you hear about the power outage at Ole Miss Library? And the list goes on. So. We've got satellite outages, National Weather Service, National Center for Environmental Prediction Center uh, predictions is uh, experiencing an outage. We can no longer speak with the MODIS, OMI, or AIRS, or the Cosmic GPS radio satellites. Those aren't speaking to us. Um, we also have power outages from Washington to Boston. You can look and you can see that AWS Amazon is currently out in Sydney, Australia, Gmail, Google Hangouts. Um, if you check the Amazon Storm Center, you can see that they have many outages up here. Coming back, mass power outages. Please report them. Boston actually nailed it, but they're only talking about Boston. Nobody's noticed yet. Um, let's keep going. So, the list goes on and on. Of note, exactly one year to the day last year, Facebook was having a very large outage. Coincidental, I'm sure. Um, but something that's really notice, uh, really weird about all this, Evernote's back up. Um, I keep hearing about planned outages. Why are there so many people reporting planned power outages that are associated with these Time Warner um, cable? Uh, sorry, we don't have any problems in your area. Uh, Cox cable, we don't have any problems in your area. We don't know why your um, modem's just blinking. But, you know, there's me saying, hey, it's global. Check it out. Um, Kitty Bitcoin, load balancing issue caused an outage. We're back to normal, though. Um, no, this is this is going on everywhere, all around the world simultaneously. MSN.com is getting an outage, and if you come over here and you do a search and you just look, the news is still just pouring in from all around the world. Um, so I started to look into it a little more. RSO Edis has eighty thousand people in Canada out. They say that it's wind. Um. I don't believe so. I don't believe so. So let's come over here to um, the Twitter tracker and we're going to just drop this on the ground. And you can see here comes the reports. Let's see. And they're just all over the world. I've been, I've been looking at this for about the last hour. Um, you name it, they've got power outages. Power outage six hours ago, seven hours ago. Power outage. Come down here to Australia. Power outage. Power has now been restored. AWS Sydney, Evernote, outage, outage, outage. Dundee Beach. All across the world. Pretty darn neat. Pretty darn neat. Kenya power out. So I was, I was uh, asking myself, so what could possibly be knocking out the power worldwide? Well, nine times out of ten, it's usually an X flare, some crazy crap on the sun. Well, let's take a look. We have a little poof coming through here. Lines up right about the same time. Boom. Doesn't seem like anything major, but we do have that massive sunspot. Currently, Earth facing our total electron content off the charts right there. White, see that white? That's pretty much the whole Earth there. Um, so, you know, look for some increased uh, internet outages, power outages, radio anomalies. Um, I think it may have something to do with this X1.6 flare that popped off yesterday at 1555 UTC. 
Um, but that remains to be seen. We'll see if I still have power when I get up in the morning. And as you can see clearly, here's our incoming solar flare. Ooh. Good times. So um, keep an eye on the power outages. They're still rolling in. Cox.com, Broadband, DSL, Haywood, Exchange, all around the world simultaneously nobody seems to notice so um yeah it's all connected and uh i'm gonna get myself to bed you guys have a wonderful day and uh of course check us out over here on climateviewer.com we'll be uh tracking all the fun i just put up a couple articles about harp you guys dig into that stuff good time harp on a boat um like I said, hopefully the power's on tomorrow, and uh, you guys have a wonderful day. And unless someone like you cares a whole awful lot, nothing is going to get better. It's not.